The next sort of colour blending I want us to look at is going to be combining two completely different colours. So I've got a green pencil here and I've got a yellow pencil here. We're going to look at blending using this same technique, but instead of going from dark to light, we're just going to be looking at combining colour pencils and combining completely different colours. And we can see how they respond in this middle area when we layer them over each other. So I'm using green and yellow, but this is going to be different depending on the colours that you choose. You might want to go for a red and a yellow. That's going to have a very different result in the middle. You might be going for a blue and a green that's going to have a very different result in the middle so I'm going to start with really you can start with either color I'm going to choose my lightest again just because that's a technique that has been working for me on these examples so I'm going to shade my area nice and lightly. We're going to be adding the layers just the same as we've done with every other technique. And then I'm going to come in with my green, nice and lightly again. We're already crossing into the yellow. Release the pressure gradually. That's going to create this blend. We can already see it's blending. Very light at the moment, but we can already see this blend. I'm going to go back in with the yellow and increase the pressure on the edge there. Still working in one direction. Quite a lot of pressure on the end. And now releasing that pressure, smoothing that out. Back to the green. So there's a lot of back and forth. We're working from each side. We're taking our time, we're working in one direction, you can't see the white of the page, there's no zigzags. Back and over, back and over. Releasing that pressure, we're coming closer to that yellow. Let it colour over a little bit. Back to the yellow, so a little bit more pressure here on the edge. Moving across. Again, my camera's wobbling because the table's wobbling in one direction along with my pencil. Over the green a bit more. And back in with the green. I think we can get this green a bit more vibrant and darker in this area. Releasing the pressure. And blending in with that yellow. So there we can see we've got a fairly smooth transition from yellow to green two completely different colours and the way that they've reacted in the middle is they have blended and they've created this sort of yellowy green which is really interesting. You can use two different colours in this in just this way. You don't have to go from one total colour to another total, total colour. If you wanted you could just lightly blend and create your own colour that's existing in the middle there. I can show you how to do that next.